Hello and welcome to another episode of Palm Beach Zoo to You. I'm Mike Terrell, General Curator at the Palm Beach Zoo and Conservation Society in sunny West Palm Beach, Florida. Let's swing on over to the zoo's Saimang Island, home to Zane, Rhea, and their new baby boy, King Louie. You're about to meet Saimang royalty. Rhea is a 12-year-old female. She's an amazing mom, even keeled, and is not afraid to put her mate Zane in his place. Zane is a 13-year-old male. He's easygoing, curious, and adorably goofy. Zane vocalizes frequently to let us know how he feels. We first introduced them through a technique called a howdy, which is a way for animals to meet and greet one another from a safe distance. In the beginning, it looked very uncertain that the two would be a match. Sweet Rhea was looking for the perfect mate, and Zane was not very gentlemanlike. Under the expert care and incredible patience of the zoologist Nancy Nill, the Saimings took the time and space they needed to get to know one another. Nancy's close relationship with each of the animals became the bridge of trust that helped Rhea and Zane fall in Saimang love. Now that their stormy relationship was settled, the next storm they encountered was a hurricane named Dorian. With the zoo under threat of Hurricane Dorian, we activated our hurricane protocol, which helps us prepare our staff, animals, and grounds for severe weather. With careful planning, coordination, and lots of encouragement from their trusted zoologists, Rhea and Zane were moved to the safety of the animal care complex, just on the other side of the zoo. It was during that time at the animal hospital that Rhea gave birth to their sweet and spirited baby boy. Born October 1st, super exciting. These are first time parents. It took us a little bit to get them together and a little bit for them to like each other. But once they did, they were inseparable. The family has bonded beautifully with Rhea and Zane easily taking on parental responsibilities. Just like human babies, the active baby Saimang was feeding regularly, gaining weight, and growing more hair. Baby Saimangs are born completely hairless, with the exception of a small tuft on the top of their head. Zoologists were thrilled to see King Louis showing natural behaviors like clinging to his mother. After the hurricane passed, the animal care team had to determine the best way to get the Saimangs back to their island home. Before the new family could be moved, the team worked on a series of behaviors to help them voluntarily go into transport crates for the short move. As a result, the Saimangs were able to be transferred completely stress-free from the hospital back home. Now they live as a happy family on Saimang Island. Rhea, Zane, and King Louis love their island, and they love the visits from their zoologists even more. Rhea trusts the team so much that she positions King Louis so that they can get a better look at him, as if she knows that they're there to care for her and her family. She's even allowed our zoologist to assist her in removing tangled fur from between King Louis's tiny fingers. At six months old, Rhea and Zane are now allowing King Louis to explore his environment, develop skills, and to climb around on the ropes or roots of the trees with his parents closely watching nearby. When he gets a little too bold or far away, Rhea steps in. But just like a toddler having fun, it takes a little maneuvering on her part. I'm sure parents can relate. We look forward to watching King Louie delight visitors and rule his kingdom at the Palm Beach Zoo. So did you enjoy learning about our Saimangs today at the Palm Beach Zoo? What did you learn? Let us know in the comments. So from Zane, Rhea, King Louie, and our entire family here at the Palm Beach Zoo, we thank you for joining us from Palm Beach Zoo to you. We hope to see you soon at the zoo.